So we're going to be practicing the fourth finger curl. This is from Simon Fisher. Put your four on the A string. And then take, if you have your bow in your hand, that's fine, but take your pointer and gently push it in. And when you do that, can you maintain this part of your hand and that not tucking your one underneath? Yeah, so when we teach beginners, we often put our thumbs like this, like right up against the neck of the violin. But it's actually in reality much more like this in a functional way. And then if you don't want to hide your first knuckle underneath the violin, the neck, because then you can't really shift and move all around the violin. So put your four on the A, and then check that your thumb stays here and your one stays out, and then can you take your other, finger, your other hand and push this in gently. Oops, that's soft right there. I think that. That's it. Very nice. All right. And then you do that like four or five times, okay? Um, and then drop your hand to your side. Not your bow hand, just your violin hand. Bring your four back up. Find the spot. You see how my other fingers are kind of wild? That's totally fine. You can wag your thumb like it's a little dog back and forth along your neck. Very nice. And then instead of using your hand to push it in, you use your, your muscle to see if you can get it to stay there. Very nice. All right, now um, tap it four times. One, two, three, four. Very good. And then we're gonna play the fourth finger song, but we're gonna stop to set the four. So listen. Set, or stop, set. Check all your, all your little components. your thumb back, that's it. As you can bring this part of your hand back a little bit. Ready, play. If you find your one is too high, that usually means your thumb is two. Your thumb's gonna be back behind where the first finger tape is, okay? Let's try it one more time. Ready, oh, and I forgot to mention, leave your fingers on the string as you go up. Imagine they're the, the stairs. Set, curl it in as best you can. Oh, keep your other fingers on the string if you can. If you can't, that might be in your squeezing more than you need to. Ready, play. We're gonna do the same activity, but on the D string, the G string, and the E string, okay? The next thing to do is something like twinkle, starting on third finger, like this. Stop, set. Should we try that? Ready, play. Stop, set. Make sure your one isn't hidden under the neck of the violin. In fact, make a credit card a slot between the fingerboard and your one. Ready, play. Time, leave your three on the A string when you do it. Ready, go. Stop. Leave your three there. Bring this part out. You might need your mom. This would be helpful. A good parent job to bring the this base knuckle of the finger out from underneath the neck. Ready, four. So you do that like four or five times, and then you do lightly row starting on four. So set your four on the A string. Ready, go. Set. We're gonna use four instead of open. Set. Oh, keep your two on the string, please. That's it, go. Make sure you're on the tip. Pause for a second, this could be back further, and this could too. Two, C sharp, ready, play. Oh, keep your fingers down, otherwise your stairs have disappeared. Stronger. Good. 
good. And then the, the, the next one is the one we've been doing in group class with the cuckoos from Perpetual Motion, where you get all four fingers on the string, on the A string, starting with one, two, three, four. I really like where your thumb is. That's awesome. Uh, and you're going to lift your one and three, so that only their four and two are on the string. Listen. Ready, play. Once again. Once again. Very good. Now I'll play perpetual motion. When I stop, you fill in the blank with a cuckoo. And then here we'll do this other trick where you pluck the open E with your fourth finger. Can you do that? That's it. Get your cuckoo ready. All four fingers on the sh oh, two and four at least. That's great. I like where your thumb is. Now to pluck this, you really want to bring your hand up high. Bring your hand up above the neck of the violin like this. That's the idea. I was changing your fourth. 